What's up, YouTube? Tenchi Arizona, the angry Dracolope of the Jackalope crew here, and I have a bit of an unboxing for you today, guys. Now, this is something that I'm not familiar with, so once I've got the unboxing part done, you'll see me looking off to one side while I check out the specifications of this particular item. Now, a few of you already know what this in this particular unboxing is about, specifically Simucom Reviews and The Alchemical Gamer. So, without further ado, let's take my Shrade Old Timer Junior, cut the tape and get into the box to get my lovely new product out. And yes, you may notice that I am not having the uh, label facing the camera because the my address is on the front of the box and yeah, I live with someone else so I don't want to be uh, giving that piece of info out. So, I'm going to try here. I'll need that later on. But... What I need right now is this. So this, this here, goes over there. And what we have, yes, a Casio Edifice chronograph watch. So let's get it out of the box and give you a look at it. Oh, and uh, by the way, don't worry if you do not get close-ups initially. While I'm talking about the specs, there's going to be some footage over here showing the watch close up using the GoPro. So let's uh, take the lid off the box, a very nice box in fact, and take the watch out. Now we get the watch on a little cushion, it's all wrapped up right now. Instruction, manual, and a few other little bits. And uh, one of those bits, uh, make sure I get the right bit, this part here is what I'm interested in. Solar powered, and sapphire crystal. So let's slide the watch off its cushion. And pull it out of the box. And what we have here, I might need to get my knife again in a minute. I do not know. No, I won't. I don't think. <laughs> Excuse me a second guys, sorry about this. I did not have any clue of how well these things were boxed. Uh, sorry, I will use the knife. Where do I put it? Ah, there it is. Just cut the string there. All that is is basically the price tag. We'll put the box on the desk and give you an initial look at the watch. I'm not going to take the, the uh, protector off the crystal just yet, but that is the watch. Right there, nice little chronograph. And, wouldn't you know, I was actually showing it to you upside down. There we go. <laughs> anyway, as I said, I'm going to read off the specs in a minute, and you will see those specs. Wrong way. You will see those specs, uh, well, you won't see the specs, you'll hear me reading off the specs, I'll be looking to one side of the screen, but you'll see some footage over here. Okay, so, excuse me a minute, because it seems I hit a key, thank you. Okay, so the band length is 22 centimetres, the band width is 2 centimetres, or 20 millimetres, Battery type is a TS920E, it has a unidirectional bezel, and that's something I actually wanted, I like something to fidget with when I've got a watch. Although, that being said, this is the first watch I've had since I was a kid, and I've had nothing of this class before. The strap is actually a rubberized strap, it says plastic, but I know it's actually rubberized. It is of course a chronograph. Circumference is 27 centimeters. The clasp type is a buckle, has a date feature. The display, clearly, as it's a chronograph, is analog. 
The glass type is sapphire crystal, so that is going to be extremely hard to scratch. The only thing that can scratch sapphire is diamond, because it's the only thing harder than sapphire. The head casing is stainless steel. The head depth is 12, millime uh, 12 millimeters or 1.2 centimeters. The head height is 50 millimeters. The head shape is round. Head width is 47 millimeters. Movement origin is Japan. Movement type is quartz. Then you've got the special features, which are timer and solar power. Has a two year manufacturer's warranty a water resistance of 100 meters, and the weight is 100 grams, or roughly 3.5 ounces. Anyway, that's pretty much it for the unboxing, and I think you'll agree this is an attractive watch. I'll be putting it on as soon as I finish recording this video. So you'll see this on all my future videos. It'll be going on my left wrist, by the way. Anyway, that's all for this unboxing. And as usual, if you like it, like it. Please subscribe, comment, and share. And remember, be good to each other. I'm the Dracolope, bitch.